Hello everyone and welcome back to some more Dust Illusion Tale. My name is Terry Prism and uh, let's uh, continue our journey. Plenty of enemies once again. Anything down here? What's all this? These flags are a warning. The area up ahead is among the most dangerous of places. Hmm. The challenges and creatures within are unlike anything you've dealt with before. Death will come swiftly if you are not prepared. I think I've heard of these arenas. It's rumored they contain precious hmm. creatures. Hey, Should we risk it? Coming back. Just little bits here and there. Think we should go in? Oh, um, I certainly hope you did. <laughs> well, we did save uh, quite a short while again. Let's go see if uh, there's anything nice. Okay, so. Where does this take us? Oh, it takes us out of there. New attempt. So, time. Oh, that game was broken fast. Oh, that was close. Up, up, up. One uh, lamp dealt with more enemies. And we need healing. Let's wait this one. And up we go. Lamp is broken. Next. Where is it? We might have missed one. Oh, giant! Giant is not good. Giant is not good. Giant is not good. Well, luckily there hasn't been any plombs yet, so that's a good. Next lamp is where... Come on. Apparently, it's not this way. It's somewhere around here. Ah, there. Where... where to next? Can I really go this way? Apparently I can! There's that and one more land. And enemies. Time to continue. Slimes, slimes, slimes. I need to get that healing. Oh, I don't have any highly any good highly healing items left. Well, we ran out of time. Oh well. No, we need to be need to be faster, otherwise. Oh well. Can I? Come on, I need to click something. Ah, exit. Okay. So what we get? Strength solve. What does it do? Hmm, still not better than what I already have. Oh well. So, let's just continue our journey now. 
Just uh, have to be careful now. Ah, that helped. Ooh, another cutscene. Meanwhile, part north. So, I guess you're Sir, Caius. The preparations are nearly complete. We found another of their camps, but... But it was deserted, of course. Keep up your search. They're going somewhere, and we need to know where that is. Of course, sir. If that's all... What of the rumors, Commander? Is there any truth to them at all? We are investigating, sir. But surely you don't believe... Commander, it is not your place to question what I believe. A moment of glory draws near, and I want results. As you wish to. Mm. Where are you, my friend? Why are you hiding from me? Hard to say if you are a bad or good guy. I uh, I guess uh, it's uh, that you're a bad guy, but um, really it's uh, hard to say for certain. Let's head back to our village. Did we get them enough imp pipes now? Please let me know if you come across those materials. I'll keep my eyes open. Apparently not. Much appreciated. I'll be waiting right here. Hopefully we get them uh, without needing to buy them. <laughs> it's great to see you back, son. I knew you could do it. The monsters have already calmed their advance. Tell me what happened. Did you confront their leader? Yeah, kind of. He was right where you said he'd be. In fact, he seemed to be waiting for us. Waiting? In the middle of a small village, surrounded by the innocents he killed. Oh, yeah. No. That could only be Denham Village. Did you find oh, any dear. survivors? Oh dear, that girl was I'm from sorry, Denham. Here, Bram, but there were none. This is bad. The creature that attacked the village was <clears throat> some kind of lizard. Wore strange armor, called himself Fuse. A lizard, you say? Hmm. A moonblood, perhaps. I wonder if Ginger would know anything about that. Ginger? That girl yeah. on the hill? Her family was killed almost a year ago in Zeplik village, a few days' journey to the north. General Gaius and his soldiers were looking for moonblood sympathizers. General Gaius? Do you know who he is? Not... Personally, his is not a name we utter here without proper cause. I've never seen him or his soldiers personally. The tragedy tends to follow in their wake. So why did they kill Ginger's family? Doesn't tell me. Helping the Moonbloods, of course. Helping the enemy is a treasonous offense. Ginger escaped, but her parents and her brother. Oh dear. Not. Regardless, I can't thank you enough for putting a stop to that mad beast before he came any closer to Aurora. If you want to ask Ginger about Fuse, I'd suggest you hurry. It looked like she was preparing to leave town for a while. Good luck. Okay. So next we need to talk to Ginger. Let's see. Alright, this was uh, the teleporter here. Do you have anything new to say? I'd love it if you could do a 1000 hit combo. That would be so cool. Nope. And all right. Now we can open this. Down, left, down, right, up. Make it good. Well, food. Teleport stone. Let's go to shop. Welcome back. Time to sell some of our extra items. We are going to equip that one soon. But uh, we don't need this strength solve. Anything else we could sell? 
Do we really need? Not really, but uh, we only get one hundred coins from it, so don't really feel like selling it either. How about those imp highs? Still a bit too expensive, uh, if I say so. We got that uh, treasure key now. We could buy one. But we got uh, about six in reserve already, so I don't think we will buy any of them at the moment. You honor us with your patronage. Please tell your friends. Your rich ones. Well, I don't really have any rich friends. Oh, you're here. Oh, Dust. We are indebted to you for what you've done for us. Gian and I are just going to rest for a bit here in Aurora. Actually, maybe you could speak with him? He would never admit it to me, but I just know something is troubling him. Of course. Where is he now? He's been pacing near the west entrance hmm. of the village, near the field where you rescued us. Thank you, Dust, for everything. Okay. So... <clears throat> Let's get to Ginger now. I don't get it. Why would anyone want to help those awful lizard things? That fuse guy burned down an entire village. Because I don't assume there are some. Richard? He wasn't born yeah. that way. General Gaius and his soldiers turned him into that monster. And Fuse is likely not the only one corrupted by General Gaius's hatred of the Moonbloods. We should speak to Ginger again to learn more about this conflict. Yeah, really good point. So, hello. Oh, you again? Mayor Bram said you left already. Yes, he asked us to stop the leader of these monsters. Turns out it was a moonblood named Fuse. He'd gone completely insane. You could Fuse. say that. Oh no. He was leading those monsters. You killed him? So you know him then? Yeah. Was he always a homicidal pyromaniac? What? No, never! Why did you kill him? He destroyed Denim Village, Ginger, and slaughtered dozens of innocent people. He refused to listen to reason and planned to attack Aurora next. I had to stop him. This war is turning all of us into monsters. Thank you for releasing to everyone. his madness. Right before the end, he seemed lucid. He told me a few things before he passed. He tried to tell me about the war, about your family. He was there the day my family was killed, yes. He was picking up supplies to bring back to his people. General Gaius attacked our village, burned it to the ground. I thought Fuse had been killed. Now I wish he had. I'm sorry. And why is that? The last time I saw an outfit like yours was the day my family was murdered. That outfit. It belongs to Gaius' soldiers. Who are you, really? I don't know. That is not an answer! Hey, ease off! Dust can't remember, okay? He doesn't even know his real name! You know, you should be more thankful. He just saved this village twice, and I... Well, I want to <laughs> do it. And I'm also really hungry! Fidget, please, calm down. She's right to be suspicious. Yeah. I don't know who I am, but I'm dressed as one of Gaius' soldiers, and that can't be good. Sounds like it. Perhaps. But your friend is right. You saved my village twice today. Gaius and his soldiers would never do that, especially if they knew I was here. Yeah. Why Tell me more Gaius about so war. Why are obsessed with killing these moonbloods? What do they do? Yeah, I like to know that too. Nothing. They exist. General Gaius sees them as an impurity, a kind of cosmic mistake that <clears throat> he believes must be wiped from this world i've tried to help where i can mm. but it's hard there aren't many moonbloods left outside of their homeland and it's only a matter of time before gaius wipes them out entirely is there anything i can do to help if only one man could stand against an army sadly no there's nothing any of us can do any hope for the moonbloods died with my family well why are you leaving town i assume it's because uh you're worried about your own safety, but uh, 
Is there anything else to it? Mayor Bram mentioned you were leaving town. Yes. The rivers and streams around Aurora are beginning to dry up completely. Without water, the only thing to do is head north. It's only a matter of time before the others follow me. Why would the rivers all be drying up? It's not like it's been very hot. And wasn't there a big rainstorm a little while ago? Someone's uh, I know, putting up a dam. Sense. To be honest, I think this whole country is cursed. General Gaius' bloodlust has scorched this land forever. I doubt we'll ever recover. So, looks like we're going to need to find the General Gaius now, next. The only way to stop this war is to stop General Gaius. Then I need to know where to find him. His campaign continues to the north. If you want to help right the wrongs of your kind, you're free to join me. I'm afraid. Oh dear. That didn't sound good. It came from the center of the village. Um, what are those? Monsters! Ginger, get down! Well, quick ending here. See you next time. Bye!